Yo. Let's see if this uh, chat fix works. Yo. Yo. My <coughs> things tell me that I'm deaf, and I thought, I thought he meant that he, he unmuted the screen here, the screen. Oh. About certain advertisements, I got about adding inches somewhere. <laughs> oh my gosh, Kane! I can hear you. Let me fix volumes really quick. I thought you sound different. <laughs> Again? No, 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 no. It's because Paladin spoke. I didn't see him come in. Well, you're bothering us right now. Please, chat, work. I don't want this chat bot to fail again. Yeah, I'm one, pin, I'm one punch to you. I thought I was Krillin at first, I don't know why. I was all bald, and I'm like, Krillin? Oh, no, it's, it's that guy. <laughs> you won't believe the character I chose. Nope. Clifford. Did you start with a red mail? <laughs> I apparently, I don't know. Was this side? Why do they call him One Punch Man? Because his name's Saitama. I don't know. I don't watch Weebafoo anime stuff. Oh, He's man. supposed to I defeat everything that. in one I punch. Seen it in like probably ten years, fifteen years, but I actually watched the first episode of Final Fantasy Unlimited earlier. Oh, he only drinks one flavor of punch. Okay. 
And sorry, I'm cheating. I'm starting already. Oh. Uh, I'm not, like, starting, starting. I'm just, like, killing this dark nut <laughs> right in front of the house over and over again. I guess we're going. Oh, we are? Do we have everybody even in? Should be. Just us three. Oh. Have a glove. Are you streaming, Putz? Yes. I'm gonna save Uncle before I forget about it. Chew. There we go. Now I got some bombs. Oh man, I wish I had another person. I'd totally like do like wrestling commentary for you guys. Oh, yeah! <laughs> Coach Jesus climbing the Tower of Power of the Hyrule yeah, Castle! Like, the, like it has someone using the fire rod. <laughs> That's gotta be Kane! That's gotta be Kane! The big red machine! No, that's Clifford! The big red dog! <laughs> what are you? What do you mean? I'm Clifford, the big red dog! <laughs> that's <is> right, yeah. <coughs> oh, nice. Got my S word. I may want to come back oh, for that. You know, it sounded like you were having trouble with your mic. You are a person. No, I don't let anyone ever tell you. I want you to look in the mirror and say, I am somebody. Nope. Should have been Arthur. I'd just be shaking my fist at everyone. I thought I heard you whenever you popped in for the first second. Um, you know, you hate, you hate how happy Alexa Bliss looks in her Instagram photos with her boyfriend? Yeah, I know, right? <laughs> Ooh, I got a bottle. And a dust. Man, those are wild effects. Wild effects. Spark. You single and miserable like the rest of us, yeah. <laughs> Dude, she just announces she's single and she's got so much sausage thrown at her. <laughs> Has anyone else felt um, slight moments of like where you kind of do the at things G keys press to Jess? The hell are you talking about? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I knew it. Like, yeah, I don't want to say anything, but like, there's just little things that I like. I tell my wife, and she's like, "Oh man, they're so new with this." <laughs> like when she actually accidentally turned off the switch, and then it like switched the input on the TV, and like GQ was like, "Yeah, you, you got to learn how to how to do that correctly." <laughs> <laughs> oh, who knows? I'd say probably, yeah. I mean, she is like, seriously trying to learn, like, Mario Kart and 
couple different games so that she can take place in it every week. So that's admirable. It's gonna be bad when she gets better than him. Though. Yeah. <laughs> I will laugh so hard if he starts talking to her the way he talks to Jumpy. <laughs> Jess, I'm banning you from my stream. So. <laughs> yeah, I hate you for minutes. <laughs> I'm at Yeah, I am too. My boy's in love. bought bombs. Nobody was sending me in. Sorry, I'm off on my own little thing. Oh yeah, we told her that. We told her if she learns the drift, she'll she'll automatically be better than Super Mutant. <laughs> I heard he got 10,000 VR. Super Mutant did. I try to pick up something new each week. Like, there's a big list of sprites. This guy named Cochise is just like, Jesus Christ. <laughs> I know, he's always, he's such a scumbag. He always plays the same game I do. I know, right? <laughs> Man, I decided to play Zelda here, and now, now he's playing it. I mean. Yeah. And then I'm trying to pick up stuff, and he steals it from me. People talk bad about you, Coachy? I don't think I've ever heard that. Oh, yeah. Like, even joking? <laughs> I just did it! I mean, you got a course in Mario Kart named after you. It's the only thing I can think of. Everyone hates it, though. <laughs> oh, I, I love that course. I love getting uh, the shortcuts. Oh, I forgot I can get Bottle Boy the full thing. Whoops. That's okay. I don't want that fairy anyways. You're free. Ooh, Moon Pearl already. Yeah, I mean, I'm just... Multi-world. You guys have made me just straight up quit streaming. A couple times. I just want to deal with y'all. I needed bombs, so I pulled a tree and I got 16 bombs. Whoa. It's like, I needed to do that before. <laughs> the way it goes, you just need one to get like a whole surplus. So. Ace Mage, do you have uh, Fall Guys on PS4? How are you liking the update? So far, it's tight. Yeah, I know it. I feel like I've played it. <laughs> there isn't much. I like. I seriously thought what they were going to do was. Um, I thought they were just going to basically not have any season one stuff, and it was going to be all season two. Same. I didn't know they were going to mix it in occasionally. Some of the games, too, like the one uh, Wall Guys. Oh, my gosh. I don't think I've survived Wall Guys yet. I've only beaten it once, and it was frustrating. There you go, Coaches. I got the Moon Burrow. All right, well, maybe we will play some, some more DKC, too. 
I gotta be ready in fall, guys, with um, with crowns for when the Paladin costume shows up. <clears throat> I pray to God that there's one that's actually called the Paladin costume so I can rub it in GQ's face. <laughs> Oh, there's no Pollen costume? Yeah, just like there was no uh, Mario All-Star or 3D All-Stars, huh? Just like there's no Switch Pro. Yeah, okay. You thought I was going to fail? What, <laughs> the bush game? I mean, I did hit 10 seconds. Uh, a little close. What's the time to get 15? Uh, 30. 30? Oh, yeah. There is an Apple outfit. Oh, that? Hey, I bought you a bottle. <laughs> hey, that's two. Is there a donut cat? I don't think. I don't, know, I don't know if there's a dunce cap yet. I'm sure there will be. The new costume, you see the newest one? It's like the director or whatever. Mm -hmm. it, it's literally just like a guy wearing a t-shirt that has like a giant beard and long hair. <laughs> I feel domesticated now that I'm in the town. Oliver, age 24, or something like that. Here, here's the... Wait, what? There's a post I saw it on. Just like some random guy. The Fall Guys community director. <laughs> That's a book. <laughs> yeah, it literally is just like a little guy with tattoos on his arm, a Fall Guys t-shirt, long hair and beard. Who got that hammer? Was that Pikes who got the hammer? Sweet, I did. And a hook shot, holy shit. Uh oh, Puts is in go mode already. Got a hammer, moon pearl, hook shot, cane. True story. I've never played all the way through vanilla length of the past. Oh, it is 15 seconds, my bad. Only through the randomizer. I don't know how I was. Like, I played through the original game like once or twice, and I played through randomizer like 50 times. <laughs> And went back and tried to play vanilla. I was like, I don't know where anything's at. Like, in order. <laughs> and then, very, very unpopular opinion. Um, one of my incentives on the follower special I did was uh, to play Ocarina of Time. I absolutely hated it. Why? I, I can't even really tell you why. It's just like... The Zelda I knew and loved, like, the first Zelda I ever did was Legend of Zelda, NES. Mm -hmm. And Link to the Past is sort of like a true sequel to it. Ocarina of Time just felt like, like, the targeting, it was like a lot of unnecessary things. Um, yeah, I, I really didn't uh, realize what it was that bothered me until I saw the sequelitis video. Sorry, it's an unpopular. Yeah, I mean, that's pretty much a band-worthy statement around here. Yeah. <laughs> I, I played through the whole thing, though. I did not quit. I played through the whole game, and I was just like... And I think maybe it was I played it too late in life. Because that came out when I was, like, probably 13 or 14. And I just played it, like, two years ago. Oh, uh, yeah. It is the first one I really remember playing. So if somebody can get me a book right now, I would love you. I know. Let me see if uh, 
the Hasharal is hiding in his illegal library. Hey, I For context, you. I'm going to be 36 in November. So. Nice. Coming up. 20. I, I played it. Let's see, what is that? 23 years later. <laughs> I found a book, but it wasn't mine. <laughs> I'm the only one without a hammer. <laughs> and Mystic's 40. I didn't know that. I had no idea. I knew it, like, last year. But in, like, the, the seven years prior that I knew him, I didn't know. Yeah, he doesn't look it at all. Why am I going to Jumpy looks older. Jumpy looks like he could be late 20s and he's 19. What looks like a middle schooler. <laughs> okay, well, that saved me a trip. though like for real whenever I like shave my beard off and cut my hair short like I could definitely pass for probably 20 21 I think I look older when I shave my face I feel older I'm 38 and if I shave I look like I'm 24 like I said before, you look like you look like a young Lee Schreider. Is that how you say his name? Or Schreiber? Yeah, I know who you're talking about. I've actually had that comparison before. <laughs> it's it's like the glasses, like I don't know. You just look a lot like a So there's some mushroom for cochis in my swamp palace. Uh-oh. The way I like my drugs. Nice and Speaking of drugs. Oh, hey. <laughs> Alright. There you go. Co cochis is bad. <laughs> <coughs> Everyone says I'm Mystic's dad. Because <laughs> I look like me and, me and my me and his me have the same hair. Oh, Even though he's like four years older than me, I'm his dad. Let me see what games there, high sound ball are. No, he played, uh, <coughs> he played Sabretooth in the, the Bad Wolverine movie. <laughs> I just died. Really? That is hilarious. It, it was, my death animation thing or whatever was a dog bowl with a bone in it. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I just death warped, but I mean, still, that's funny. Wow, that's crazy. There's actually a picture of him when he's younger, and he looks exactly like you. I should really be going Dark World. Oh, yeah, I can find you. That's you. Forgot I had access to you. 
He's over here trying to clear out Eastern Palace. anymore but when I was probably between five and like nine or ten I looked exactly like a copycat of Macaulay Culkin <laughs> all right all I ever heard everywhere I went. do the thing put your hands on your cheeks leave me alone So my stupid chat broke again. <sighs> Damn it. I thought you said you didn't want to play. You're trying to play my game for me. I have no idea what's with the dislikes. It's not Splatoon, so people suck. <laughs> You sent me the shovel. You sent me boots. I sent you boots. Oh. Oh, I sent a flute to Mog. Oh, yeah, that's right. You know, and that shovel led to my bow. All right, Ace Mage, I'm going to have a bowl of cereal, and then let's play some DKC2. What kind of cereal? Uh, yeah, that's right, you're a cereal guy. Uh, I'm probably going to do some some nice apple cinnamon Cheerios. Ooh. Sort of lower that cholesterol a bit, you know. Sounds good. That's some plain game. Right? Have yeah. you tried the, uh, the uh, Dunkin' Donuts mocha cereal yet? Oh, I haven't seen it. Dude, I'm telling you, it's like, it, it, it quickly topped my list on favorite cereals after this long off all the cereal I've had. The best way to describe it, it's like what Count Chocula used to be. Ooh. Like how old are you? I am thirty two. Okay, so you probably remember when the change happened, right? <coughs> mm -hmm. Like Count Chocula was like cocoa puff caliber chocolate and then the marshmallows were like kinda chocolatey and then like somewhere along the line the cereal wasn't like five dollars a box anymore. It was two dollars a box, and it tastes like kicks with like, like flavor with marshmallows. Yeah, yeah. It's it's basically what cow chocolate used to be. Little hint of coffee flavor. It's not like strong though. Speaking of coffee, I didn't go get mine. Oh yeah, they're gonna be around every October, and it tastes like crap. So I have tempered now. Yeah, it's it's here. I'll post the link for you guys. You can look at it. What?
Let's say I had mushroom. And then you frosted mini wheat. See, I like I like mini wheat, but it just sucks when you get to the bottom of the bag. Like you don't get that like you know the dust and stuff. You know the the leftovers. You just get like it's almost like trying to eat hay. Man, I am making all the right plays. So I have not tried the uh, caramel macchiato yet. I may soon. I'm just not a caramel guy really, but here's the link to the cereal site. So yeah, the mocha latte is amazing. Bucks. Nice. I just found my boots now. I'm like finding everything. Crunch berries? No, it does not make you poop a lot. It's not a diuretic. Thursday was National Depression Screening Day? I don't, I don't, I don't I already know I'm depressed. I don't even think it's. Marshmallow screen. spread? I don't need to get screened for that. <laughs> yeah, I kind of feel the same. Oh, I love pierogies. <laughs> pierogies are so hard eaten in the contest. It's like, imagine like a like a noodle, uh, but it's like a casing, sort of like a ravioli, and then inside it has like mashed potatoes and cheese and stuff. Like, you saute them in, like, butter, but basically it's like a noodle ravioli type thing filled with mashed potatoes. See, where I'm from, we pretty much just call that the KFC bucket bowl. <laughs> well, we have KFC here, although I'm more partial to Popeyes, because I like my Cajun style. Man, everybody's getting tons of bottles. National cake decorating day. <coughs> Hug a drummer day? But they never show up on time, right? That's the joke. See, I can't talk too ill will about drummers because my dad loves drums. <laughs> Man, Ace Mage, if you had like, if you had Popeyes, um, their mashed potatoes with blackened gravy. Gosh. This is why I can't go on diet. Oh, yeah. Stuff like this is too good to eat. Well, here's, here, you want to know the secret? Because I've studied this. <laughs> like, if you want to lose weight, um, this is what I do. No joke, I've lost 25 pounds in the last couple months. Um, I started walking like once or twice a week for like maybe five, six, seven miles, um, which seriously does not take as long as it would sound. What a sucker. Um, and then for breakfast, you drink your breakfast, usually something like a protein shake just to make sure you don't get hungry. So maybe like 160, 170 calories. Then for lunch, you eat less than 500, so something like a microwave meal style. And then for dinner, you eat whatever the heck you want. And Good. usually the most fatty, high in calorie thing like KFC or like a burrito from like Chipotle or whatever is usually right around 1,000 calories, maybe 1,000 to 1,200. And yeah, that's all I've done. Even having a snack at night, like cereal or something. So I've been eating like probably between like sixteen and eighteen hundred calories a day, and I've lost like twenty five pounds. I think my problem is I just don't do shit. <laughs> Dude, I'm I'm a streamer. <laughs> Dude, like I come home and like I think I like stay up too late and I don't get enough sleep. What do, you, what, do you your job? what do you do at your job? I just sit on my butt. <laughs> Unless I got packages to go deliver. Okay. So, I mean, yeah. 
literally walk like five miles a week, which takes like two hours. When everything started happening, where like work slowed down a lot, like I've noticed, I just I don't walk nearly as much as I used to. Kimberly Day, like the Pink Power Ranger. I can get behind that day. Yeah, I think she was every young boy's crush. Yep. And she knew it. <laughs> Sausage pizza day. Oh, I can't celebrate the first one. <laughs> Rita. <laughs> now I'm wondering if my other chat broke, because nobody's saying jack shit. Yeah. <laughs> Those are tomorrows? Oh. Team, you're gonna need to yell that. Friday, Saturday, Sunday? Nope, never mind. Somebody just spoke. Apple cinnamon Cheerios time. Yeah, your chat was all kinds of excited when you switched to Splatoon earlier. I was like, damn, I missed Mario. <laughs> Well, after I made my placements, I went pretty much back to uh, Mario 35 for a game. And then I won the first game I played, and then I'm like, I'm good. He's been playing, I uh, forget what game it was. He's probably still playing that game. Uh, are you a soda drinker, Coaches? No. Okay. I was going to say. Yes, that Chromeway. I have the answer to that, too, for people who love soda and can't kick soda. Is it that, is it that TV or whatever it is? Or. Zevi is okay. Uh, yeah. Not bad. They have actually pretty good root beer and pretty good Mountain Dew knockoff, Mountain Zevia. But the two that I recommend is Virgil's Zero Sugar Cola. Virgil? And, um, Blue Sky Zero Sugar Cola. It tastes like Coke slash Pepsi, but there's literally, it's, there's like nothing in it. It's like vegan soda. It's all sweet and there's stevia, things like monk fruit. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we get uh, we get some stuff like that for uh, for dad where he's he was borderline diabetic. Yeah. So, and then he has to have like some form of caffeine because he doesn't drink coffee. What's up, Nixon? All right, it's more crap. Yeah, monk fruit. Um, it's basically just like a like an actual fruit that grows uh, on trees, I believe. I mean, I guess that's don't all fruits grow on trees? No, strawberries don't grow on trees. But um, yeah, if you look it up, you'll see it. it's it just looks like a fruit. And apparently the extract from it is like sort of sweet and kind of um, cinnamony like. So like the sodas have like a cinnamon like aftertaste, but not like overpowering. And then there's the other thing that uh, is a natural sweetener that has no sugar is uh, erythritol, which is literally um, 
when sugar ferments, it turns to like sugar alcohol, and that is actually like um, it has a sweet taste to it. So you can sweeten soda with it, and there's literally no sugar in it at all. Erythritol. No, they don't. I've never had any problems. No inverted exclamation marks, please. Yeah. <laughs> Hell jumper. He get. Uh, I swear he said like lasagna just tears him a new one. Like, just lasagna. <laughs> Let's go back up. I don't know what I'm doing. Maybe you're lactose intolerant? I don't know anybody who lacks toes. Anything I think lasagna would like clog you up. I mean, it gives them like, as he said, pure chemical warfare level of gas. Oh, I just realized the bowl says Clifford on it. What I want to do a dairy mash with me. Like cereal has to have milk. I ran out of milk and actually tried to put um, my wife's unsweetened almond milk in the mocha cereal. Don't do that. <laughs> my hint, a dog exists somewhere. <laughs> Yeah, cereal almonds are still good too. Some cereals are actually better than others, but I don't know. How the hell do I get a hint about a dog? S'mores cereal without milk? Wow. I could eat Golden Grams all day without milk. Nut. Basically, what is nut juice? Nothing goes with cereal better than breast milk. <laughs> I will have to try that sometime. Jack Burns from the Fockers. <laughs> oh God. I have dimples, Greg. Can you milk me? <laughs> well, I don't know. Do you want to be milked? What did you send me, Cochise? Uh, I think it was bombs or money. It wasn't nothing good. <laughs> oh man, I'm not out so deep. I have plenty to do, I just don't know where to go. I know where to go. from his character in Heavyweights. He plays like the exact same person. Heavyweights was a good movie. I liked it. Oh, I don't want to pull up my map.
I think we watched Tropic Thunder. I don't know if you were here or not. Hell jump there. Ooh. Golden yeah. time. Yeah, Rip Torn. Rip Rip Torn. Dave Break from Study. F and A, my kick returners is out now. Two of them. They're quitting on me. Alright, I need a lamp, a sword, or something here. <laughs> Damn. Studying porn. <laughs> oh, I don't know if I can do this. other kind of fantasy football. Ooh, I checked that. Nope. That's all I can do here. DKC2. Actually works very, very well. That's why I was like trying to get some some people to play. I thought that the maybe working like co-op would be a little problematic, but Dixie Kong. Dixie Normus. Country too. He doesn't play games. Uh, Ace Mages. I was the last time. Pugs are the superior dog breed. What the fuck? I'm Kong Diddy Kong Diddy Diddy Kong Kong. Oh, now I get a sword. Uh, the password, I'll give you a hint. It's one of the only bands from the 90s that has a three-digit number in their name. I think I've seen them before in person. No, there's no band called 420. 
Although they probably do a lot of 420. I think I seen that band in person, but I think I blinked and missed it. It's just a three digit number. There's nothing else. Oh. Never mind then. <laughs> Here, I was going to say Blink-182. <laughs> there you go. Alright, so Down, down. The last show I went to was uh, the Alice Cooper and Rob Zombie show. For a while. When was this? Uh, it was like 2011. Or later. Yeah, it is a good show. I don't remember that. I was only like 10 or 11. I was just like. Rock and roll, man. Girls are gross. No, I got, I got one. No, I liked girls at that point, but I was like too awestruck by the guy who was on Wayne's World. He even mentioned it too. He was like, "Anybody ever see the movie Wayne's World?" <laughs> what a way to introduce the song. Oh, crap. I forgot. Random bosses. I got my own red t-shirt. There you are. Alright, what's the password? Three eleven. Alright. Don't you tread on me. Out of the Motley Crue reunion tour. 
It was so boring. Damn it. This fight is so fucking hard. Oh, I didn't think I could hit that. That makes this easier. Um, it's a program that does yeah, it. It was called the Jägermeister Tour. That's the one that I mentioned in, uh, we're playing Jackbox that I actually played on stage. Oh. I was in the front row, like, head bang. <laughs> and, uh, the guitarist, while they were in mid-song, now this is at the pageant. I don't know if you guys know St. Louis very well, but the pageant is probably the second biggest concert venue in St. Louis. So it's like... You know, a couple thousand people probably. Um, and he, like, I read his lips and he was like, You play guitar? And I was like, Yeah. And he was like, One minute. I was like, Oh my gosh, what is he doing? <laughs> and then he just, like, reached, he tells the security guy, he's like, Pull him up on stage. And he's like, Throws his guitar to me. And I'm like, I gotta be honest, dude. I'm like, I appreciate it, but I don't know any of your songs. And he was like, just play something, they'll play with you. And I was like, alright. <laughs> Man, talk about adrenaline. That was like a high, like I can't even describe, like scary. Ah, oh, I got it. Found it. Yeah, I wish, dude. But I don't think I could make up a story like that. You just have to trust me. I mean, you can look up the, the concert venue. It was, uh... Let's see. Saliva was, like, the headliner. Head P.E., Breaking Benjamin. Uh, Systematic. I remember the other one. I think there five bands, though. I couldn't make a story like that if I tried. You, you guys know Lizard Man? That guy that's like covered in tattoos and scales and... Yeah. Yeah, he was there. He was like the poster boy for the show. You know Spooky Man? <laughs> Spooky Man. Yeah, the butt rock band. No, there was no Nickelback. <laughs> My favorite band used to be Metallica. I've been listening to their uh, s and 2 album. I haven't heard it, but I've listened to them in probably 10 years. <clears throat> yeah, that was another cool instance. I went to the... It was at Gateway International Raceway, and it was uh, System of a Down before anyone knew who they were. Um... Power Man 5000, Kid Rock, gosh dang it, died. Kid Rock, Power Man 5000, Korn, and Metallica. Needless to say, I was only there for Metallica. Yeah. Like, Power Man 5000 is <laughs> like that one song. It's pretty much moved off the stage. He was trying to be all, like, inspirational and, like, give a speech about, like, how we need to take the world back from the, the powers that be and all that. And this one guy yells out, shut up and play. <laughs> and he was like, hold on, hold on. St. Anger destroyed you? Like, I, I remember not caring for St. Anger when it came out and then I went back and listened to this. 
I, I think I liked it more after the Some Kind of Monster. Bob Rock kind of ruined Metallica yeah. at that time. I was even okay with Load and Reload, but then uh, whenever they did Stanger, I was like, okay, yeah, you guys need to go back to your roots. Okay, I put this off as long as I could. Ace made this level super dangerous. Lars and his trash can drone. Yeah. <laughs> I remember like reading an article because I was like so sour from that. And it was like we have good news. <laughs> you know, like, what is it? It was sort of like a troll thing. They were like, uh, Lars turned his snare back on and Kirk played a solo. <laughs> they were like, Metallic is back! <laughs> Last album I ever heard from it was Death Magnetic, and it was like return to form. Yeah, they actually, uh, there was like people that, um, complained about it, like how the sound was, it wasn't like basically recorded in high definition. And then some guy, I forget what it was called, it was, um, it was like a project or something, it was like re-magnetic or something like that, and he like turned his, uh, he did like a whole remaster of it, like probably like a month after it came out or something. I'm sorry about that, Ace Mates. I just threw him to his death. <laughs> My bad. I was wow. to throw you over that guy and land in the center, but it didn't work out. That is interesting. And this game's soundtrack is godlike. discovered Amazon music is like a whole new world. Favorite death album? Uh, probably Sound of Perseverance. I think it's one. Is that the one with the uh, they call for a painkiller on it? Death? Oh my gosh, I haven't heard that name in a while. I actually used to listen to a little bit of death. Uh, but primarily is In Flames. I don't know if you've heard them. Mm -hmm. They're like Swedish guys. Their sound is just so good though. Don't underestimate Christian metal, by the way. Favorite bands is Demon Hunter. Oh yeah, I've had one of their albums. They're really good. Uh, and then there's like Sayo. A lot of people don't realize Kill Switch and Gaze is like the Christian band. Creed. Creed. <laughs> Christian metal. Creed. <laughs> Napalm Death. Did you ever have the uh, hear the uh, the Mortal Kombat movie soundtrack album? I don't think so. Oh gosh, it had like it had like Napalm Death, KMFDM, uh, Gravity Kills, um, Fear Factory. Oh. 
gotta you gotta do the roll and then jump at the end of the roll. Oh god, you give me ten seconds. Had to be Hamasaur. No, don't do that right now. I was one of those try to get there a little quicker or something. Gracie Lords, whenever she started doing techno music, she was in it too. I think she did the the song that everybody knows, like the Road Oh, really? Yeah. What band would you be embarrassed to admit that you like? Um, oh, I know mine. No <laughs> way! <laughs> <laughs> okay, so it's not a band, but it's a uh, it's one of those like guilty pleasure songs. First of all, I will never, ever turn off Toto Africa. And if That's you do, song. you're not human. But my guilty pleasure song is uh, What's Up by Four Non Blondes. You guys know what's up? I didn't go to my fucking forum. Who are you going to fucking leave? What the hell? Wow, you are playing with assholes. Have they never heard of drowning poor pre Dave Williams' death? Fucking idiots. That is all. <laughs> no another thing. Fuck those guys. Self righteous fools don't know that is all. Fuck yeah, man. Yeah. And god damn it, Zoll, another hundred dollar donation. Jesus Christ, dude. That is just huge, man. I don't know how you keep doing it. don't mind to admit that I do listen to Hootie and the Blowfish sometimes. You hear that? He's a Hootie and the Blowfish guy, too. Positive. Yeah, when, when's the, the wedding? I don't know. You want me to name a band I liked as a kid? That was my favorite? So this is a good discussion, though. This is, I like where this is going. <laughs> this is good content. I was a big Beach Boys fan. So, if not a band, Coach, he's Guilty Pleasure song. Hang on. Plus, was you <laughs> surfing USA or whatever? What song is it? I was Kokomo, man. Kokomo? <laughs> Yeah, I'm not. I'm not gonna lie. Britney Spears has some jams. Oh God! Really? <laughs> um, I, I thought Baby One More Time when it first came out was catching when I was like 12, but that was pretty much it. So here's another bad thing with uh, my thing not working properly. Uh, I can't type in chat, but it's. Twitch.tv slash Cochise788. What's up, Maria? Madonna's C O C H E S E. If you're going to say like a virgin, I would expect uh, Weird Al like a surgeon. 
Oh yeah, dude. Like a Weird surgeon. Was, like, probably one of my favorite artists of like all time. Cutting for the very first time. <laughs> the fuck is this? That was one of the, the old school ones, like a surgeon. You know what song that I heard? It was a mashup. Um, <laughs> is one less E. It, it's only yeah, one it E. Blaine Beavis and Butthead. Blaine Beavis and Butthead, because they showed the music video for the Beastie Boys and Sabotage. That's where I got it from. Fuck the check. Like, if you can... That is, like, one of the best episodes, too. He's just like... He's just like, yes! Yeah. He's like, oh, yeah! He's like, all right, Viva, now shut up so I can enjoy this. Yeah. If you see the uh, log for the items, his name is right there. Viva, shut up. All right, I'm gonna shut up. He's like, keep going. I like how they're like, so, so when's the... When's the actual video come out? <laughs> this is the video. Oh, Jesus Christ, I can't kill him. Oh my god, Mog, finally. Potion I shop? They were my gloves. Shipping himself in a box the whole time, Beavis is like, bow, 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 I just got an amazing hint. He just gives in. He keeps telling him to shut up and he keeps like hitting him and everything. Then at the end, Bud Head just like gives in, just starts doing it too. I actually just got an amazing hint. The green pendant leads to a red rupee for you. Nice. Well, no. That sucks. Oh, the, the mashup song that I was going to say was, uh, it's the Rick Astley Never Gonna Give You Up song, but it's mashed with uh, the Backstreet Boys, uh, whatever their song is up there. Surprisingly, You know what's hilarious? Oh, says Clifford, picking Stop, something up. Sticker bush symphony. <laughs> Looks like I'm sniffing something. This is probably not one of the best game tracks in Donkey Kong Country, but one of the best video game uh, soundtracks, like period. Shit, I do have to kill the boss.
You had to pin me, didn't you, you son of a bitch? Well, screw that, I got my mitts. Yep. I got somebody's bow in a minute. You just farted? Okay. Granny Smith apples. I remember I was like six or seven and I like bought my first book. It was like a Star Wars book. And I was like, how much is this? And she's like, it's six ninety nine plus tax. And I'm like, what does that mean? <laughs> she's like, six ninety nine plus tax. And I'm like, how much is tax? She's like, uh, like 6.25%. Oh, okay. I'm seven, so now you've cleared up. <laughs> they, they had books in West Virginia? I'm sure they do. I mean, I'm in Western Virginia. There's your boots. So oh, glad I checked that first. Got my, my Dobo boots. Yeah, they had books. And they, they were mainly like, you know, your typical kid books. And then the ones I always look for were like, how to cheat in video games. Like, All right, this is my jammy. Did you ever like go to the like gas stations and then like get the code book out of the plastic and write the codes down? I did that at the grocery stores and they got <laughs> mad at me. <laughs> like when people used to ask me, have you ever stole anything? I'm like, I've stolen information from a book, but I didn't actually take the book. Whoa, that was weird. You sent me that rupee and my blue cane up here turned blue. I turned into a blue rupee. Well, I am the sexy one, so I've stolen a lot of girls' hearts. Oh, look at that. Are you fucking kidding me, game? Uh, Ace 
just made? Is your switch freaking out? I'm getting like a crap ton of lag. Uh, I'm lagging. He just opens the menu and pushes save state. <laughs> Gotta be careful. Have another freaking sword, Cochise. Nice. Level three. I'm ready for Ganon. Where am I taking this chest? I'm going over to Hype Cave with it. I've already done Hype Cave. Okay, whose bow do I have? Go cheese, have silvers. Yay. I got some silvers. Got my slivers. <laughs> Diablo randomizer be fine. Fun. What would it randomize though? I mean, I'd hate to have, like, a barbarian that had, hmm. like, technique skills or something, like a necromancer, sorceress. It's pretty wimpy. Let me know if you need ether there, Cochise. Um, I know I don't need it for Misery Miner. Because it's in my spike cave, so I'm not getting in if I don't have to. Here, I thought I would have saw Zol in your chat. Do what? I thought Zol was going over to your chat. I haven't seen him. I knew that. I don't know why I did that. Still got checks. Never seen do that. I still don't have lamp, I still don't have fire rod. I don't have lamp or hook shot.
The blue king can be found in the sewers. Well, that's the last check I had in there, so I guess I don't need it. PS2 also. Well, see, the PS2 also had that, uh, the scary screen of when your game would be all red. Sad sounding. <laughs> the disc cannot be red. I don't I know either. One might be my favorite. I got scared of the game over screen in Super Mario Bros. So I can't say no. Or the game over music in uh, Duck Hunt. There's my damn book. <laughs> like I knew once I started missing shots, so like I had time to quit. Uh, I don't want to hear the game over sound. <laughs> Ooh, drop frames detected. Astro Grover is legit scary. It's, it is way too spooky. I might even make a better Twitch emote of it. Just shaking his head. Have a cane, Cochise. Oh, heck yeah. Now I'll go do Ice Palace. No, the dog wasn't going to shoot me. It's just... It's just the sound. I'm going to be nice and get a heart for somebody. Astro Grover. Go look that up. Y'all don't know what I'm talking about. You get an incorrect answer. You want to talk about the... Do what? What system was it on? NES. Okay. I don't remember that one. It was part of, like, Sesame Street... Um, oh, Grover, okay. Yes, yeah, Grover, yeah. Well, now. People say the Majora's Mask move is scary, but I show them Astro Grover. <laughs> <laughs> I am running out of checks really quick here. Game over screen in Astro Grover? Just when you get an incorrect answer. Okay. Like the moon gets very upset with you, disappointed. Honest, dude, I had to stop watching when you were playing that uh, Teletubbies game. <laughs> was like, I, I seriously, because I was like starting to like doze off and I was like I gotta stop this cause I'm gonna be like it's like nightmare fuel oh, I completed it so <laughs> never had it, to play it, it started it started feeling like kinda like fever dream territory <laughs> <laughs> kinda like the way the, the uh, agreeing aliens were in Sesame Street but yep 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 uh huh uh huh I got grabbed again. One punch man got grabbed twice. You need to parry yourself. Yeah. 
first round. Did you find the Chromely? Who did it turn into? I turned into like Chinese Luigi or something. We're in the that um, the beehive level, the first one in DKC two. Remember the level when uh, King Zinger starts chasing you? Mm. That music. Yep. Yeah, you don't you don't know um, anxiety. So you've heard that. <laughs> this fight too much. Blind on the dang treadmill. It's like that level in uh, <laughs> Super Mario Land was like kind of racist. Like when you go to Chinese Land. Oh yeah. I never understood that too much. Like, why, <laughs> why are we here? <laughs> You're like killing Chinese, jumping on Chinese people's heads. Mario was the original Hatalia access powers. Did you listen to the sound for a while? That's the sound. That's a sad sound. The sound of disappointment. I'm afraid of it. <laughs> Why I get upset with Twitch chat when I can't get their approval. Hmm. <laughs> Flashbacks of Astro Grover. Yeah, I was like three when I played that game. It's still smooth. I was afraid of the dumbest crap thing. I guess they're really expecting uh, me to do this fight. I used to hide behind the chair when a certain F3 am thinking about this. <laughs> like, what my chair is going to look like. He's tried watching Alf as an adult and still there. <laughs> Kill. I don't like Alf either. He's a fan of these cats. So he's a bad dude in my book. Damn it! Like Stop him. giving me shit! <laughs> Boss, it's hard enough! Sometimes, I mean, even as an adult, like, you like, you like wake up in the middle of the night, you throw some clothes on a chair or something, and then you like look over at the chair, and then you gotta do like a double take and be like, what am I looking at right now? <laughs> Something's bothering me about this. Okay, I really desperately need health. Damn it! This fucker killed me twice now. The stupid ice thing, whatever. Uh -oh. And I only got fighter sword, so I got to use the fucking hammer. I don't know what the fuck I can do anymore. I really don't. I can't kill this damn thing. whenever I was a kid, too. My mom got it for me. She's like, isn't it cool? And I'm just like, are you kidding me? Are you like, this is a joke? I tell you what, as soon as I knew what it was, it went in the closet and it did not come out. <laughs> like, I seriously remember putting it in the closet, face down, underneath a bunch of stuff, closed the closet. I wouldn't even go in there during the daytime. <laughs> nope. <laughs> I actually just recently watched the uh, the new one. This movie's stupid, but man, Mark Hamill. 
as Chucky's voice is like terrifying. A James Brown bobblehead in your house and it freaked you out. Too, whenever you're like a kid and you have one of those uh, like animals that makes like a growling sound and the batteries get low in it, <laughs> it goes off in the middle of the night. I had one of those uh, the Billy Big Mouth Bass things that oh. <laughs> the batteries started getting low on it. I was like, oh god. Oh. Jesus Christ. Yeah. You don't sound very happy yourself there, Billy Big Mouth Bass. As soon as I start fighting, you guys keep sending me shit. <laughs> no! Come on. Fucking win this fucking fight. Oh, yeah, it works. Yeah. <laughs> I'm about to quit. I cannot beat this, and this is the only thing I have to do. I can literally do nothing else. Let's do it. So if you have one of those crappy Kmart trolls, 
Without a jewel, you were you were nobody. You guys just glitched me. No. <laughs> oh wait, maybe I did it on. I did Thank God it worked. Challenge one time. I used to have that like Fraser Island one or whatever. Yeah, I think my now that you're mentioning it, I think my dad like rented that one time. <laughs> Every single Friday night was, like, he knew it was Mega Man X2 and Mortal Kombat 2. Don't rent anything else. I must master those games. And, like, one time, like, they didn't have anything, and he was just like, I just grab what I can find. <laughs> and every once in a while, it would be some weird freaking game. But to answer a question, sure, Zol, if you want to do one, I don't mind. It's a bit to set it up, but... You were like... <laughs> we didn't even have the K. Just risked his life for an N. We didn't even have a K. <laughs> so as I just hit the final blow, I get Tempered Sword. Ace, which would have saved me so Ace much time. Made. Just for that to be my flippers. When he missing my hair shut, had a sword for me and a sword for him. Well, somebody just gave me master like a few minutes before hit, so. Oh, uh, yeah, sure, Zol. I'll definitely do a duo. Jerk birds coming up that always get me. Right here. Or no, it's not. It's the guys that, that, that throw boxes at you. Shut Hey, Mog, did you give me armor in Skull Woods or no? I think so. Okay. It was in my Skull Woods? Yeah, that's what I got a hint for. I wasn't sure if you got it from there or somewhere else. Yeah, I've already been in Skull Woods, so I probably... Okay. I Owning on NES, I got from my grandparents' video rental place. Actually, playing Paper Mario. So, does that mean you had a very big Nintendo collection? That's the game I've been playing. Actually, made me rethink it. It, it's a lot of downloading stuff to get it set up, though, but, yeah, I can do that. Mimic Cave? Have fun in Turtle Rock. Didn't say who, so it's got to be you. Made you ready to have Jedi reflexes? I lost a lot of my manuals because of uh, when we moved. I just had them all in a big, huge shopping bag kind of thing. And I don't know what happened to that bag when we moved. And that would be the PS5, if anything. I'm probably holding off on the PS5, though.
here is how hook shot. Is that the only thing you're missing? It's always nice. Well, now. The force was not <laughs> that opens a couple dungeons for me. Basically, like Mega Man 8, but without the warnings that are verbal, they're only visual. Jump, 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 slide, slide, jump, slide. It doesn't tell you when the road's out. You ever notice I seem to be the last one with swords in every single time we play these? Did I almost kill ya? in my mint cave. Nice. I still need hammer though to get into turtle rock. Okay. Okay.
Okay. Nothing. I didn't even, I wasn't in green chat. Talking about like borrowing games and stuff. It's the note that I left. Did you ever find out what your Turtle Rock was, Coaches? What? You ever find out what your Turtle Rock was? Oh. I am dropping frames like crazy right now. So the only thing I could do is two pendant dungeons right now. Misery Mire or Ice Palace? I'm in Misery Mire right now. I choose Misery. Because this sucks. Well, you could do all the checks in the beginning part of the dungeon. Well, 
think this is really true. So. Found my magic. Still no fire rod. What am I going to win? Imagine Kane have been getting it right first try. You just got to leave it on the color that you want to press in. I've been learning about it. I think I mainly sneak and do this when you're not looking or something. Master system, more like disaster system. Oh, got him. <laughs> Acquired him. Obtained him. <laughs> <laughs> That's what the, uh, his comment of, like, oh, God, called it, why? I took us to the, uh, the club of stage. Oh, why? <laughs> Those are bad. <laughs> I wanted a challenge. Oh, wait. Uh-oh. You have to beat it. Well, that's not good. All right. Can't leave until we beat it. There's like two crashes in this one. One of them is like a TNT crash that kills you in one hit. And then there's one that's like all black with red eyes and every time he bumps into you, he steals a life. Yeah. Oh, we almost had Where did I get that? 
quake, okay. Really early. I've even used it and didn't even mark it. Okay, we gotta do a cartwheel into a jump on those big ones. Those fucker, you gotta spike those. Three of my dungeons are fire rod blocked. My fire rod? I'm dropping frames like crazy in my stream. Kochi's my magic powder is in your pyramid, Barry. I don't know if I need it, though. What's your other right, crystal? Last try. I'm only gonna call it for the night. Okay, vanilla big key.
good try, man. Uh, we'll get through it. There's your lamp. Huh? Holy shit. <sighs> Wonderful time. Had to be on the boss of Ice Palace. Which was which was my third pendant dungeon I just did. Misery Meyer was a waste. Yeah, I'm only going back to Misery Meyer if I have to. Pinned it for me. I missed the chest, so I gotta go back. Alright, everybody. Have a good night. Later, Paladin. Later. Thanks for hanging out, man. And according to Zola, your music sucks. Stop! Oh, I'm screwing this up so bad. through, damn it! Faster going than the roundabout. Right. 
Didn't see that fight coming. It's going rough. And not because I'm a dog. <laughs> oh, oh, my hook shot. Ugh. <laughs> Holy shit. Turtle Rock had your hook shot? Ugh. The boss did. A bolt can be found in Spiral Cave. Thank you, I already got that. Was it the first chest? Uh, is the one... Yep. Yeah, the one at the bottom. And there's Mog's hammer. Deep in my ice palace. <laughs> oh. Is that one in Bonk Logic or what? Yes, that is Bonk Logic. Oh, I didn't know. Or I kind of forgot. That's all good. We all got our go items at once. With my skill. I just picked up the skull, so never mind. <laughs> Get out of there. Thanks, game. Have some magic. <laughs> A little too late, but it happened anyways. Alright. At least you get to a free refill. going. Should be finished up in the next 20 minutes, I think. Did we 
done by 20 minutes. That's what I figure. I got shit I... done left to do. Well, you're in go mode. Mog is in go mode, I think, right? I still need a bow. Ooh, okay. So 30 minutes then. <laughs> That's half a bow. So your bow is probably in my turtle rock at this rate. Since I could now just get there. And it's going to be on laser bridge. I'm calling it now. I 
don't know. I just remember something like pyramids or something. Or time tunnels. I appreciate you stopping, five point. Yeah, jumper dripping story. It's normally pretty dead when I play Zelda. But I've been dropping frames like crazy, so I don't think many stuck around after that. I have no idea, Majin Kane. I played it today. Isn't that good enough? Kochi saw me play. <laughs> yep. After the wedding. <laughs> Oh my god, he hit this guy like a... No. When did I learn to drift? Your trip to Tokyo. That's when you learn to drift. Oh, it wasn't your trip to Tokyo? Oh, yeah. <laughs> How many hours was it again, Puck? It was like 3,016 hours. For what? For what exactly? Battlefield 4. My dad's hours is on it. Oh. Profile. I don't know. And yes, I'm still streaming. I think it's only like 2600 or so. I don't know the exact number. figure
It's still funny though that you managed to burn the <laughs> the crouch icon, the gold crate bars, the health of it, and uh, the mini map onto the TV. Pretty bad. The crouch symbol. <laughs> like other two I can you know give a pass on the crouch symbol. No, I didn't know. Like, the, the bars at the top are there. Like the, I forgot what, what they were. At some point, it wasn't conquest mode, it was the gold rush. Well, I only got two more checks. That's Pyramid Fairy for both. Yeah, it's like a, like two little health bars and a big red health bar. Vanilla ball. I feel like I sit too close to my TV. Not because like my eyes hurt, but just like it's just so much on the damn screen. Like I miss the crap out of the time. Silver. screen is more like it's supposed to like it's more natural for you to like kind of like immerse yourself in it as well.
Yes, I am really playing as Clifford. <laughs> Did Mog ever find his bow yet? No. Well, I'm out of checks. Maybe your silvers, which would be technically your first bow, is in my GT. I go check the rest of my ice pals. That's probably going to do I wonder if it's just something dummy missed or something. Holy um, there's a ton of sprites. I can pull it up in a bit. I've been fighting Armos Knights with the bu without the bow. This is my third Armos Knight. Ouch. Do you at least have a gold sword? Yeah. Wow, my big key. Troll location. suck anyway, so it doesn't matter. 
pays to be a member. My timing is great, isn't it? My uncle has the Oculus. Yeah, probably something like that. Where they can just buy a bunch of them. Yeah, I don't know why I'm dropping so many frames. Sorry, guys. Uh, yeah, I do drink a lot of water. Today, I didn't. Today I drink a lot of milk. Yeah, I'm kind of agreeing with that. Like mine started off great, and I got stuck. Mine started off really good. Seriously, I gotta use a frickin' potion.
go check the old man. Forgot <laughs> I am making mistakes. Um, I have the game. I don't know when I'm going to play it, but I do have it. have it. I'm seeing about making a big burger. Screw you, Aga. Wait, what? Did my game glitch out? Yep. 
There's one check I did, and it said I didn't do it. I'm positive I did it. All right, catch you later. I had to hopefully permanently disable that uh, activate window. No, nope, I'm good. Hmm. My windows is activated. I'm running in I always enjoy a good bowl of fruity pebbles. Yeah. Oh, my God. Try And I am done. Beat the game? Yep. Already? Wow. I checked all of GT. There was no silvers there, so...
Because bow cannot technically be in GT, but silvers can. But since it's progression, it could have been there. But everything else I had hints for, so... Yeah, me not having fire rod for as long as I did also hurt. <laughs> it was all just a chain reaction at the end. Yep, third line. Mog not having hammer for a long time hurt too. I can't believe your first sword or whatever was my Zora. <laughs> so if, if you if change the bosses to be only one thing, you made them all blind, would that be considered a blind run? Maybe. I'd have to look into it. <laughs> That's their own mistake. <laughs> If that powder leads to Magic Bat and his uh, bow, I'm check uh, pedestals. They are. Tablets. My lost wood credit says he's got wood. <laughs> Negative two for every bad joke in your joke. All right, Goose, how high can you count? If I named my character Rocket as Clifford, would I be Red Rocket? <laughs> There, I, I got worse jokes than Kochi's. <laughs> I guess that red toy pocket too yet? No, I don't think they've shipped it yet. They were kind of backed up on stuff. I haven't checked. I was going to check it today and I completely just forgot. <laughs> I was hoping that, uh, you know, ordering the solid black, uh, you know, plain Jane model and ship out quicker. I was kind of torn on uh, getting the, the Indigo one. Or maybe one that looks like a Game Boy or something.
They have some other models that are out that might be slightly cheaper. I don't know how well they run and stuff, but I wanted that one because it has the Wi-Fi built into it. Mog can forfeit me if he wants. Just uh, double check. Because yeah, that uh, the retro YouTube thing. Yep. Your ether. That was it. Yep, that was it. Uh, that retro pocket two. I like the triggers on the top because they're kind of like this. Some of the other ones have like a button here and a button here. That's your L one, L two. Uh, I didn't want that too much. Did you bomb the desert one? The chest or whatever? The one with uh, Sasharal's brother or whatever in it? Yeah. Yeah, I did that. That does get missed a lot. I've seen a little bit of it, Mermaid. I'm not quite sure what exactly it is. Is it a VR only game? <laughs> He did? <laughs> wow. Alright guys, I'm ending stream. Catch you later.